Dell Latitude 5490 Review Pros, fast performance, long battery life, comfortable keyboard, plenty of security options Cons, uninspiring display, poor audio, heats up Verdict, the Dell Latitude 5490 is a speedy business laptop, but its display disappoints the 14-inch Dell Latitude 5490 is built for work, with plenty of speed, durability and comfort. With an 8th Gen Core i7 processor, the Latitude 5490, tested at $1,509, starting at $799, enables you to blaze through your to-do list, multitasking away with a keyboard that feels great to type on and a battery that will make it through the day. But if you're hoping for your work to look great on your screen or use your laptop to listen to any audio, the latitude falls flat. Even with those caveats, though, this machine is a productivity powerhouse. Specs CPU Intel Core i7-8650U Operating System Windows 10 Pro RAM 8GB Hard Drive Size 256GB Design the matte black latitude 5490, with a carbon fiber lid and underside, and a plastic keyboard deck, feels quite sturdy. Ever the minimalist, its silver Dell logo sits square in the middle of the lid, the keyboard is slightly recessed into the deck and a small sliver of its power button glows white when it's powered on. Weighing 3.8 pounds and measuring 13.1 by 9.0 by 0.8 inches, the Latitude is heavier than the 3.5 pound Lenovo ThinkPad T470, which weighs 3.9 pounds when upgraded to its 6 cell battery, which is a slightly larger 13.3 by 9.2 by 0.8 inches. The Latitude splits its ports among its left, right, and back sides. Its HDMI port, optional SIM tray and first USB 3.0 port sit on the rear, while the left has its singular USB Type-C with display port, smart card reader, SD memory reader and second USB 3.0 port. The right side has a VGA port, a headphone jack and a third USB 3.0 port. Businesses with old monitors and projectors will appreciate the VGA connector. Security and Durability the Latitude 5490 is built tough, so you don't need to worry about treating it with tons of care. The laptop passed 14 different mil spec tests, the same ones that US military equipment must survive. That means the laptop has endured vibrations and drops onto the floor, withstood getting sand and dust blown at it and survived climates as cold as minus 20.2 degrees Fahrenheit and as hot as 140 degrees.